Hello ladies and gentlemen of YouTube, my name is Brad, this is my channel Animate Orange, and today in 3D Metal Model News. Usually I turn my attention to Fascinations or Peace Cool for what's new from them. Really, there's nothing but the same old stuff on there right now, still waiting for the new Star Wars Helmets models to come out, and still waiting for the Looney Tunes models to come out as well as the space models that they've shown in the train still waiting on those who knows when they'll come out i imagine at least the star wars models will be fairly soon because honestly that's probably a money maker for them and they'll want to get that out there so i turn my attention to aliexpress where i've done a little bit of looking around through some of my favorite sellers looking for new models one of the first things that shows up from the magical magical model store is a Galaxy Craft Scarlet Knight YM-NO61C from MU. I've tried to do some looking around to find out what Galaxy Craft is, if it's a thing, if it's a TV series or an anime or something. I can't find anything about it. I went to the MU website and it's listed under the military series section. So if you know something about Galaxy Craft, please let me know, but I'll show a picture of it and give you a link to what I found. But it's an interesting looking sort of red and silver craft for you to build, a little complicated, a little uh, futuristic looking, interesting craft to build. And it's listed along with a couple of other military tanks and a somewhat futuristic looking wheeled tank-like-ish vehicle, as well as a mini aircraft carrier that I've seen before. So that's one of the new things that's listed. Um, I have built some while well, I'm working on the MU right now. Those are pretty decent models, pretty complicated models, but I'm really enjoying the Megatron that I'm building. So those are some to check out. Now looking at Crazy Carts Store, and their new section is a series of Peace Cool models, architecture models that look very similar to the Iconics models. I believe they're the same, same kind and same size. And they do have a lot of models that you can find in Iconics here in the States as well as a few models that you can't. Now some of the models that you can find on these Peace Cool models that you can't find in Iconics are the Yellow Crane Tower, the Temple of Heaven, the Patronus Towers, and I'm gonna try and say this right, the Sunamun, Sunamun? There's another name for it as well, but that's what they're calling it. Those are really neat looking, so that's something new. Probably not really new product, but it's new on AliExpress. There's lots of other things that you can find new on AliExpress, a lot of knockoff models. I don't like to talk a lot about the knockoff stuff and the copycat models because they can really be of low quality and honestly, as far as unique models and licensed models, I personally prefer to try and support the companies that have the license rather than the knockoffs. It's a little bit more money, but if they go out of business, then everything goes out of business, including the copycats, and we lose these neat new models that we enjoy building. Sometimes I like to take a moment during these news segments to talk about a different model company, and one that I don't believe that I've really talked much about yet is Picture Kingdom. And I've built one Picture Kingdom model so far, and that's the Optimus Prime in his truck form. I enjoyed that build. The metal was a little bit uh, squishier or flexier, it wasn't as stiff little bit more challenging to work with but the end result the end model was really neat and they do have some other neat models now now quick search on aliexpress is only showing one store and a five models being carried and that's in crazy crazy toys stores shop nothing else out there on aliexpress seems to carry them and i thought they had a wider range i've tried to go to their website picturekingdom.com but it's not coming up today i don't know what's going on if maybe there's just not a lot of models available and i haven't really noticed before or if their catalog is shrinking but the ones that they do have are really neat the gate of darkness the judge the apocalypse tank and the terran battleship look like really neat complicated and awesome models to build so while they don't have a very wide available catalog at this time the ones that they do have are pretty neat and i think it's worth mentioning really enjoyed the Optimus Prime model that I built. Again, the metal, a little bit more challenging and delicate to work with, but the end result and the complicated and, and details of the model made it worth it. So that's another model series to check out. Maybe some will come available later in time, but that's what we have right now. And on one final note, Metal Earth is running another contest at this moment. I think I mentioned this before, but it's the Metal Earth Mod Challenge just a simple modification to a Metal Earth model. 
submit a picture to them and you can enter their contest. It doesn't have to be complicated. You don't have to have fancy equipment. Just a simple picture of some simple mod to one of their models to make it different, interesting, or, or unique. You can find out more about that contest and how to enter on their Instagram or Facebook page. And of course, all the stuff that I talked about, I try to include descriptions or links in the description down below, including links to Metal Earth's Instagram and Facebook page. I'll leave it at that. Not a lot of new stuff going on, but you know, feel free to surf AliExpress with the links that I give you to find out what else is out there because there's really a lot of different models out there. Just beware of copycats. As always, thank you for watching. If you enjoy these videos, consider becoming a Patreon supporter or just give a tip through Ko-Fi. You can find links in the description down below and a link at the very end of this video. Thank you for watching and keep on keeping on.